Hello and welcome to Teacher of Loss channel. In this video, we are going to work on fraction of a whole number. Before starting to solve, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and like the video. We have some questions over here which are taken from the primary mathematics of Cambridge, which is for grade five. So the first question is, Two third of fifteen. To find two third of fifteen, we first divide fifteen by three, which gives us five, and then multiply five by two to find two third of fifteen. So five times two is ten. We can say that two third of fifteen is equal to ten. Means if we divide. 15 and 3 equal parts, 2 of them will be 10. In the second example, we have 3 fourth of 24. The same way, like the first one, we first divide 24 by 4. So 24 divided by 4 will give us 6, because 6 times 4 is 24. And then we multiply 6 by 3 to find 3 fourth of 24. So 6 times 3 will be equal to 18. So we can write that 3 fourth of 24 is 18. This means if we divide 24 into 4 equal parts, 3 of them will be 18. The third example is 3 fifth of 60. So we follow the same rule. First, we divide 60 by 5 and then multiply the result with 3. 16 divided by 5 is 12. Because 12 times 5 is 60. 5 times 2 is 10 and 1 times 5 is 5. 5 plus the 1 from the 10 is 60. And 12 times 3 is equal to 36. So 60 is divided into 5 equal parts, 3 of them will be equal to 36. So the fourth example here is 6 seventh of 84. 6 seventh of 84. We divide 84 by 7, then multiply the result with 6. So 84 divided by 7 will be equal to 12. Because 7 times 2 is 14, 1 times 7 is 7, 7 plus 1 is 8. Now 12 times 6 will be equal to 72. It means if we divide 84 into 7 equal parts, 6 of them will be equal to 72. In the last example, we have a word problem. In this word problem, it says, Zahra has one-fifth of a bottle of milk. One-fifth of a bottle of milk. There are 100 ml of milk in her bottle. How much milk was in the bottle when it was full? Means one-fifth of something is equal to 100 ml. 100 ml. How much is the whole bottle? Or how much milk was there when the bottle was full? To do so, to find how much milk was there, we multiply 100 by 5 and it gives us the number here. So 100 times 5 is equal to 500, which in this case is ml. Means there were 500 ml of milk in the bottle when it was full. This is all about fractional part of a whole or fraction of a whole number. I hope it makes sense for you and helps you learn how to find fractional part of a whole number. If you learned something from this video, like the video, 
and share the video with your friends and classmates. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Have a nice time and thank you so much.